well I'm telling you that worshiping the Holy Ghost leads to greatness by worshiping the Holy Ghost it enables greatness that other people can't access Proverbs chapter 18 and verse 16 a man's gift makes room for him and brings him before great men so what brings the man before great men the gift the word great here and the word before means face to face or to become like so you you will become a great man or a great woman you're gonna be you will become equal to the great people of the earth right if say if, if if you follow the gift so many people don't follow the gift they follow something else they want it some other way so the things that God gives you that if you pay attention to it if you follow it if you embrace it if you take it upon yourself it will do what make you a great will make you equal with the great people of the earth a man's gift makes room for him and brings him before great men so if God brings a gift and gives you a gift right and you pay attention to it and you um, apply yourself to it then the promise of that is to make you great or to bring you in line or at the same level with the great people of the earth so I worship you Holy Ghost it is a gift that's been given to you through the gifts of the Spirit through the ministry of the Spirit it is something that's been given to you and if you follow that meaning you begin worshiping the Holy Ghost you continue worshiping the Holy Ghost you will be brought to what greatness well I'm telling you that worshiping the Holy Ghost leads to greatness but the problem is a lot of people don't continue they might do it once they go oh, this feels weird so if we're talking specifically about worshiping the Holy Ghost and saying the words I worship you Holy Ghost has been given to you as a gift if you use it if you come face it will make you come face to face with greatness say face to face, face, to face with greatness. greatness what's gonna make you that gift it's been given to us I've spent a lot of time how did we get to the point of worshiping the Holy Ghost what brought us here well Jesus brought us here his whole ministry was to bring the Holy Ghost into the earth and then he could go away and so we were supposed to be walking with the Holy Ghost in the earth so that when you when you go okay I'm gonna say I worship you Holy Ghost it shouldn't be some foreign thing that I don't know how I got here I don't know how I got in this room no you walked up the solid straight and narrow path that led you to this door that you walked through and now you're in the room worshiping the Holy Ghost where are you going with this it's not just where I'm going with it where are you going with it you're going on to greatness because this is part of the gift it's a gift and see a lot of people would think well what about the manifestation only the manifestation of the Spirit is a gift no you don't even the manifestation of the Spirit brings you revelation the revelation that you have is a gift but if you fully occupy that space of worshiping the Holy Ghost as God in the earth today it will bring you to greatness Amen. what will the gift because if you keep going here it will radically change your life it'll radically mess up your weird theology and it will bring you in line with greatness see that's what happened to Solomon he was nothing until the Holy Ghost came on him and when the Holy Ghost came on him he was like man he so what brought him to greatness Holy Ghost what brings you to greatness Holy Ghost and particularly again I'm talking about worshiping the Holy Ghost as God in the earth today it will bring you to greatness where did this whole concept and idea of worshiping the Holy Ghost as God in the earth today we have to know where it came from are you so foolish having begun in the spirit are you now made perfect by the flesh don't get mad at me when I say this where did you begin you began in the spirit now are you gonna be made perfect or made mature or brought to as we're talking about today to greatness by dependence on the flesh no dependence on what then dependence on the spirit right so as you're worshiping the Holy Ghost and how many times have I talked about you got to begin at homeroom you got to go to homeroom which is worshiping the Holy Ghost you're beginning there and then as you go from there where do you go 
higher and higher you move on to greatness where worshiping the Holy Ghost you're gonna be perfected there you're gonna be brought to maturity there you're gonna be brought to greatness there because in the worship of the Holy Ghost is greatness the gift is to know who to go to and what to do when you're there that's a gift some people have no idea well it doesn't sound like a gift you have no idea how great of a gift it is that you have that you can wake up and go I worship you Holy Ghost you're God in the earth today and as you continue that I hope you're hearing some of this within that and doing that is greatness so having begun in the spirit so you have to continue from where you began if you continue from where you began it's gonna take you to a different trajectory it's gonna take you to a place that other Christians can't go because their trajectory is off yours isn't leading to the cave in escapism yours is leading to greatness I mean you may not believe me and you know and you you might not until you start doing it but worshiping the Holy Ghost on a daily basis more and more say more and more, more, and more. what does more and more mean more and more. well more and more right it means it doesn't a uh, little bit and then none <laughs> right the more you do it the something's gonna happen to you you're gonna change you're not gonna be the same person it's not that I don't love you the way you are but you're going to change and what's gonna change it as all you know completely rewire you to greatness whose greatness his greatness that's embedded and impacted inside of the gift so people I'm telling you people who don't worship the Holy Ghost are not enabled to enter into all that that gift has for them That's right. by worshiping the Holy Ghost it enables greatness that other people can't access did you see that your trick your trajectory is enabled that should make you happy because it made me happy when I heard it your trajectory is enabled you can't get there from here but you can get there from Holy Ghost worship so there's a place in the spirit there's stuff in the spirit there's greatness say greatness greatness, greatness in the spirit that you can't get to apart from worshiping the Holy Ghost who's God in the earth today I hope you're here this is exciting yeah. so if you continue on in it it's gonna bring you to greatness you have an idea where you're going isn't this wonderful your trajectory becomes glory to glory once you know where the message came from once you know how you got here you're solid on it you can't be shaken from it you've covered it from every angle then relax you're not going back you just you're gonna enjoy the ride enjoy what it does to you enjoy when it changes the way you think about something enjoy going from glory to glory and being changed enjoy the ride the journey I'm talking about is the daily worship of the Holy Ghost and how it changes you and you go from glory to glory because it's going to take you to greatness greatness awaits you my friend if you continue on in the spirit worshiping the Holy Ghost well if the Holy Ghost is God in the earth today and you're worshiping God that's going to open up and enable things to you and favor to you that isn't going to be enabled and opened up to other people the message comes first how can you believe the message or do the message if you don't have the message first you can't so if you know and you have the message that the Holy Ghost is God in the earth today you that has to come first well within that message if you do it comes all the other great things will lead you to greatness it's James chapter 1 verse 22 but be ye doers of the word and not hearers only so the message comes first you need to worship the Holy Ghost I worship you Holy Ghost should be part of your daily vocabulary it's a gift that's been given to you within that gift is gonna lead you to greatness greatness if you do it and if you do it more and more I did it once first we have the message then we have the doing the message is worshiping the Holy Ghost who's God in the earth today then the doing is what if the message is worshiping the Holy Ghost who's God in the earth today then the doing is what worshiping the Holy Ghost who's God in the earth today right then but the manifestation of the Spirit is given to 
every man to profit with all so to profit we're gonna be given manifestations of the spirit that are unique to you to cause you to profit to cause you to do what to become great where would all this be in doing the gift what gift specifically worshiping the Holy Ghost and let the Holy Ghost begin to change you as you worship him let him open up new spaces for you let him bring you to greatness expansion will come from here the gift the man's gift makes room for him expands the room and brings who to greatness the man who's doing the gift the one who yields and follows the gift okay obedience to this message will bring greatness job 36 11 I'm almost done if they obey and serve him they shall spend their days in prosperity and their years in pleasures one of the way what best ways you can serve the Holy Ghost is by worshiping him by obeying the message the thing that he brought you to and what's it gonna do obedience to this message will bring greatness following the gift obedience to the gift doing say doing doing, doing the gift will produce greatness what is greatness the standard the measure the excellence that's the top say the top the top in any field know that it will produce greatness obedience will produce greatness so relax enjoy the ride where's the ride taking you the ride is taking you to greatness what's the greatness being equal with the great people of the earth that's you Holy Ghost I thank you that you imparted this message to them today and great things are coming as they obey and walk with you in the earth mm -hmm.